Now tonight's first quick comment and an update on your help during the crisis on the reservations in South Dakota. Cheyenne River Tribal Chairman Joe Brings Plenty advises us that about 95% of the power is back on. The top issue now remains the troubled water infrastructure. FEMA says just today the gathering of information has been completed, which will let the administration and the state issue its preliminary damage assessment, the assessment without which FEMA can't begin to provide funds. We're sending a producer to South Dakota to get some sense of what's going on on the ground. As to the charities, and these are all still linked off our site, countdown.msnbc.com, your generosity is overwhelming us and them. Your contributions to Cheyenne River Sioux Tribe Storm Relief Emergency Assistance are now at about a quarter of a million dollars. Chairman Brings Plenty told the Sioux Falls Argus Leader newspaper that the donations will pay for permanent generators in the shelters, for mobile trailers to be used as emergency command centers, for blankets and pillows, and home repair. It's amazing, he said. It's actually started coming before any federal relief came in. The newspaper also puts this in more visceral terms. Bob Sutton, who set up that website, rigged his BlackBerry to buzz each time there was a donation online. He was at dinner Tuesday night when we first mentioned his fund. It was unbelievable, he said. I had to go into the lobby and check it. I thought something was wrong because it just kept buzzing. Well done.